second race is the junior free-for-all pacing field. Here they come. There, off and pacing. A strong start attempted by Electric Stena. Roughed up down the center of the track. There goes Umbro Positive to the top. Umbro Positive, positively the first leader. Driving on with that one goes roughed up. Tony Kerwood keeping that one to the outside. Southview Sabre Electric Stena is up into the top four. Racing five back is False Alarm to the first turn. And Rare Earth is the sixth one away. A moving third from last. Ribbon Man ahead of Mizoja. And Thunder Bay is trailing. 25 and 2. They made the opening quarter. Armbro positive, roughed up, is getting really roughed up. The first three-eighths of this mile, closing the gap in third is Southview Sabre. Right there, Electric Stena, readying to capitalize from fourth if he can. False alarm sits just off the leaders from fifth. There goes Southview Sabre, up on the attack on this hot early pace. Moving fourth from last is Rare Earth, just ahead of Ribbon Man, Mizoja, and Thunder Bay. Southview Sabre, roughed up, Armbro positive, made that first early fraction, sits back in third after being hard spent, and Electric Stena is tipping up from fourth. 53 and 1. Amazing speed here for a mid October night in Toronto and another leadership change onto the final turn. Southview Sabre takes over from the hard spent, roughed up. Here comes Electric Stena. Right there is False Alarm, second over into the top four. Rare Earth moving well on the outside from fifth. Armbro positive, used up early, is now back in sixth. And Ribbon Man along the inside, Mizoja and trailing. Thunder Bay is out of contention. Electric Stena turns for home. One 22 three quarter time 28 and four third quarter electric stena is electrifying by four lengths one more move coming from false alarm false alarm is closing in on electric stena electric stena condren goes to a heavy drive he's going to get him home though that's electric stena holding on over false alarm rare earth was third finishing fourth ribbon man armbro positive fifth tying the track record in an astounding 148 and three was the electric Electric Stena Woodbine's all-time track record has just been tied. Yeah. The second race winner returns, and it's a memorable moment for Electric Stena. The four-year-old son of Cam Fella from Toxic Tanya, owned by Les Ecuties Stena of Montreal. Trained by Colin Johnson and driven to a share of the Woodbine all-time all-age track record by Steve Condren. 148-3 ties Dragon Again's track record. For Electric Stena, fourth win in 18 starts this year and a life's mark in his 20th career victory. For one of the finest ever to come out of Quebec. Another speedball like Goliath Bayama. This was Electric Stena's night in Toronto in 148-3 at Woodbine. Steve Condren equaling the uh, all-time track record here at uh, Woodbine. That's to be pretty special to uh, take your place in history. Yeah, it was kind of, you know, the, the faction set up that way. But, you know, you got to give all the credit to Colin Johnson and, and his barn. You know, the people there, they are just done a hell of a job with this horse. We're going to get a look, I think, at the stretch drive coming up. Uh, let's talk about the fractions up front. Were, were uh, they responsible, do you think, for setting up this time tonight? Oh, definitely. Uh, <clears throat> right from the get-go, you know, I could tell the first eights was very strong, and they just kept motoring from there. And uh, there was a little bit of a break, a 16th or so past the half, and that's when I moved, and I just kind of rolled that out. And then I saw the three quarters. I said, I'm going to try to put a record on this horse, and it worked out good. All right, and uh, just talk about getting away from the likes of Gallo Blue Chip uh, had to make a big difference as well. Oh, yeah, this horse was chasing him the last couple starts. So, I mean, you know, he dropped into a, I wouldn't say a softer bunch, of just no Gallo Blue Chip in there, and uh, I think it made a difference for him. And let's just talk about track condition. Uh, we had a lot of rain yesterday, and uh, you said you think it's uh, really made the track much faster. Yeah, this track always knits up good after a good heavy rain, and, and it's showing it tonight. I mean, 48-3 and three tonight with a pretty stiff wind. That's a pretty good mile. Okay, congratulations, Steve Condren, equaling the all-time track record. Good luck the rest of the way tonight. Great, thanks very much. All right, right ahead, race number three.